<laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna try this again with a rifle this time. I wasn't gonna do this today. I just made a video how to sight in my muzzleloader in uh, two shots. Didn't work out, did not have very good results. Um, I will post that one before this one, so you might wanna check that one out too for educational purposes if you like the muzzleloader. Um, yeah, I'm shooting a, a 270 Winchester with a Vortex Diamondback scope. Um, it's a four by 16 or 416 by 42. Um, shooting 130 grain Federal. Um, seems to have pretty good luck with those. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try doing a two shot zero just like I did in the other one where I take a shot and then my second shot, I'll line up my, or I first shoot, line up uh, my crosshairs with the uh, cro uh, bullseye that I was aiming at and then move my crosshairs over to the bullet hole and hopefully I can get it within an inch in two shots. already. I'm just going to stick it in the magazine. I don't know if I mentioned this is a 270 or a 270. You do that. Uh, it's a Ruger American the rifle. So let's see what I can do here. Um, have a difficult time today with uh, well, with everything. Just gonna adjust the height of my uh, there we go. Stick this rag in here again, keep it steady. All right, um, I have no idea if I got on paper or not. Can't tell from here. Um, I will quickly go and check. So it looks like I ended up quite low, but like dead setter. Um, I am going to see if I can find a way to find that on my scope. I forgot to bring a pen. Um, I might actually have to run back and grab a pen. See how good I can work that out so I can move my crosshairs down to that mark there. Try this again. All right. I just did my adjustments, taking my second shot now. Um, starting to rain here. Let's see how it goes. So my slide doesn't slip off of here. Wow, that's pretty well, well that's on the bullseye, just a little bit on the right part of it. So I'm going to take one more shot real quick, see where I end up with that, just to confirm it, I might have to make some micro adjustments, but for the most part I should be zeroed in, and now my gun is being stupid.
All right, let's go take a look up close, see where we're at. All right, so this is my attempt at it with the rifle. This was first shot made by adjustment. This was my second shot, made no adjustments. That was my third shot. Um, so, looks a lot better <laughs> than my muzzle loader did. That's, uh, whatever that is, that's a little bit of a shooter error, I think. I think this one actually is shooter error because this one lines up closer to this. Either way, um, it's kind of starting to rain right now, so I'm gonna call it a day. Going to my brother's place tomorrow. He's bringing uh, power belts back. He's in the city right now, so I'm gonna try the power belts in my muzzle loader, and then I'll make some micro adjustments to my 270 if need be. Uh, yeah. Well, thanks for tuning in again. Um, yeah. Check out my muzzle loader video if you're into that kind of thing. Definitely, kind of, will show you what not to do. Um, Whatever I did, that's what you don't do. But yeah, thanks for watching.